Mm. Wait, Velma, what the... What are you doing inside my house? Good morning, Patrick Senpai! What the actual heck is wrong with you, Velma? Oh, did I scare you, Patrick Senpai? Hee <laughs> hee! I just wanted to tell you that there's a new person in town. He must be fancy because he has a nice house and a flash kitchen. You should go visit him! Okay, one, could you please not consider being really creepy and waiting at the end of my bed? And two, yeah, I'll, I'll talk to him. I'll take care of Grayson for you while you go to the next, to the new guy's house, okay? Last time you tried to kill Grayson because you don't, you two don't get along. But I'll trust you for this day. I'll make it up to you, Patrick Senpai. Alright, alright, alright. So obviously, that house that was there on Valentine's Day... Velma's been playing with the potatoes again, and she forgot to close the bathroom door. <sighs> Alright. It's raining. Um. Hmm. Huh. The moment when I say it rain, it starts. To... It's raining, um. It just all of a sudden changes. Okay, um. That's kind of weird. Aha! Taxi! Taxi driver? Taxi at the other guy, at the new guy's house, huh? And it looks like since the new guy's been here, the supermarket's been made. All right. I won't talk to you. I'll talk to you later. All right. I'll just in case, I'll just come in. Hello. Who? What? Who are you? Uh, it, it's all right. I'm here to introduce you to the town. It, it's it's all right. What did you come into my house for? I wanted to introduce myself. Okay then. What's your name? My name's Patrick. I'm fairly new here. I only came here like five months ago. And you? Uh, <laughs> my name my name is Jeff. Seriously. No, I was trying to hide my real identity. My re my real name is Jackson. I work for the government as an agent. I'm here to investigate the area because we feel that there's a criminal in the area. This town. You want to help me sort this out? Sure. Alright, let's do this. Um, so. Hmm. What do we do? Alright, so. Alright, so what's the quest? Find the criminal. Alright, alright. So, by the looks of it, I have to kill John Cena and, um, Henry. Good, good. I've done that before. Well, I've done it with John Cena, not Henry. I mean, Henry's just had his birthday a couple of weeks ago. So, I don't want to be really mean. I'm gonna go check on Jerry. He said he was moving to the army. I'm kind of worried about him. Like what he's done with this place. Hmm. Nice. Wait, mailbox. What's in the mailbox? I'm gonna be nice. Yeah. Mail from. Is this from the government? Nice. Oh my gosh! Gary, there's armor in here. Yes, the package in the mailbox is from the government. I don't really mind the armor and the gun. My question is, how do they fit it in the mailbox? In that box is prototype armor. Do you know how dangerous that is? The gun is fine, but the armor has even been tested. Guess, well, um, I don't think it has. Why you come to my house anyway, dude? Well, I'm helping a government agent find a criminal and have... I came in to check on you, see if you are hurt. Well, I'm fine. Now, you go get that criminal. He or she or they may be very dangerous. Good luck being put into the army. And you have fun haunting those criminals. I will. Yeah. Just wait until he finds out that the uh, criminals are John Cena and Henry, apparently. I'll put that back. Hmm. 
Right, so I'm gonna go get into my house. And get the baseball bat. Velma's still waiting at my bed. Um, don't mind me, Velma, I'm just grabbing my baseball bat. <laughs> I'll be back. She's, she's probably just sitting there wondering what's going on. I'll go check on Lilac as well. She might be at Velma's house as well. Alright, so the door is not open. So that may be proof that she's here. Lilac? Ah, oh, she's still sitting there. <sighs> Alright, so I. John Cena usually hanged around the diner a lot, so I gotta find him around the diner. I don't think he'd hang around these bushes and stuff. You can't see me. Yes, I can. Ah, got ya. All right, now I gotta find Henry. He'll probably be at home. Oh man, I'm hungry. Hello, Henry. Good day, mate. Sorry, bro, but I have to do this. Ha <laughs> ha! Alright, now I gotta go back to Mr. Jackson and, uh, go talk to him. <laughs> now I'll just walk. Never mind. <sighs> Taxi still hasn't moved. Must be waiting on him. Alright, I'm here. Hey, you're not too bad after all. Maybe I could live in this town for a bit. It needs my help, as well as yours. Thanks. Oh my god. I didn't know there was a reward. Okay, um. I'm gonna have places in my drawers. Wow. What a nice guy. He's a little bit creepy, but still. <sighs> I feel sad for Henry. And his girlfriend, too. If he gets accepted to the army, then... Who knows what might happen. He might die. Hey, Doc Grayson! Meow. I'm gonna steal something. Same thing. I got some money, Velma! Isn't that great? Yeah. I wish we would just leave. Hmm. Alright, I'm gonna... Go wander around the town for a bit. Hmm. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? I'll just walk over here. I'll just go around here. Hmm. Man, I love this town. It's beautiful. That mountain. Maybe I should go see it. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, let's go. <sighs> Oh man, 
This is going to take quite a while. Ah, oh, sorry, I got lighters. It's all uphill from here. Isaac. I knew there was something up about you. I knew you were on the mountains. It's time to take you out. Ow! <clears throat> Goodbye, Isaac. <sighs> I think I found the real criminal. I need to go find Jackson. <sighs> Times like these, I wish I had a bucket. Jackson! I don't think he'd be able to hit me from here. Jackson! Jackson! I'm coming. He's awake. Oh, what happened? What happened? You fainted at the doorstep. Pretty rough. You also badly wounded. What happened? I fainted because I found out who the real criminal was. And you tried to fend him off. That's what I love about you. What? Uh, nothing. I mean, I love your jacket. Yeah, it's pretty nifty. <laughs> and, well, anyway, you're going to need to, a better weapon. Speak to Jerry about it. He was really concerned, too. I will. Uh, how am I going to explain this to Velma? She's going to be super mad. Taxi's still out there. Um, gotta go quick, gotta go quick. Come on, go, go, go. Pretty sure I also need to grab some food. Just stop by my house real quick. Um, no, 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 no. Oh. Glory of having Velma, uh, she can bake. Yeah. 
Jerry. 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 No need to explain. Just go. Catch Isaac. He shall pay for his crimes. Oh, this is heavy. All right. <laughs> Thanks, Jerry. Let's go get Isaac. Alright. Let's go, go up that mountain. Let's find Isaac. Let's shoot him down. I understand what Lilac and Jackson meant. This gun does like tons of damage, I'm pretty sure. And the dagger did like small hits. I only had a certain amount of life left, as a matter of fact, that I fainted at the doorstep of Lilac's house. Well, correction, Velma's house, but hey. And. Did I catch a glimpse that possibly I may have been flirting with him? I'm coming for you, Isaac. Up I go. All right, let's do this, Isaac. Crap, 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 crap. Survived. Oh, I'm gonna faint again. All right. Um. Just slowly go down this cliff. Got Isaac. He will pay for his crimes in the court. Not by my hand. Nor Jackson's. You know, Lilac's, even though I'm pretty sure Lilac would really like to punch Isaac in the face. Powerful woman. <sighs> Alright, come on, let's go. <sighs> Starving. I don't want to faint again. <sighs> Alright, keep control of yourself, Patrick. Quickly get over there as soon as possible. Tell Jackson that he's on the mountain, which Jackson will now then tell the police and they'll arrest Isaac. Quickly.
<sighs> Trixon, he's all yours. No need to worry about him, Patrick. He's going to prison. He will not affect anyone anymore. He won't be hurting anyone anymore, not even you. Ha! You're not as stupid as I thought you were. Good luck next time you meet me, because it won't be as easy as last time. No, I guess I am. Uh, I'm not, am I? Huh? Yeah, that's right, you're going to prison. You're going to be safe away from all this. You right, Lilac? Just so you know, I'm fine. Probably this Velma. Yeah, Velma's waiting at the door. Hello, Velma. Patrick Senpai, you okay? What happened? It's a long story. I'll explain it when we get home. Come on, let's go for now. And thank you, taxi driver, for being here the entire time, even though you practically did nothing. Come on, let's go. Come on, Velma. Hold up. Well, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Um, that's another awesome episode of Average Patrick for you. I know, the new guy. Um, so we, so in this episode, we found out that Jackson would be in it. He need be a secret agent work for the government. Um, besides from that, it was pretty mysterious. Who's this Isaac guy? What has he got with links with Patrick? Well. We'll see in the next episode, won't we? Well, guys, could we reach like 800 views and like 20 likes, maybe? And then I'll do the next episode. So, yeah, guys, um, thank you guys for watching. Good.